Okay, pick up the phone. Damn it. Get up, Maxi. I just need to the phone. Let me know you're okay. Open the door, Lulu. Just let me explain, okay? Come on, open the door. Lulu? Open the door, open it up. Just let me talk to you. Lulu, Maxie's fine, okay? It's not as bad as it looked. And why is she still lying on the floor? You know how Maxie is. She gets off on causing trouble, okay? This is just another one of her games. She knows I was coming up here to, to explain what happened, and she's just trying to play this thing up to make it look a whole lot worse than it really was. Well, you, you seem pretty angry. What were you fighting about? Look, Maxie's upset because I still care about you, okay? She was practically throwing herself at me. I told her no, but she wouldn't back off. What you saw was me getting Maxie to back off. By beating the crap out of her? Okay, Lulu, I know it must have looked, but I swear it was all just a big misunderstanding. Okay, that happens a lot with us. Uh, you remember that time a few months back when you hit me in the head with that wrench because you thought I was a killer? You put me in a coma. I could have died, but I forgave you because I knew you never meant to hurt me just like I would never, ever hurt you. Yeah, what about Maxie? Look, Maxie knows you can see her, all right? She's just playing this up and milking it for all it's worth. You're not going to open the door, are you? Okay. You want me out of Johnny's life? Is that what you want? Here. Go ahead. Do it. What are you waiting for? What's going on? <laughs> you don't have to be afraid. I just want to explain. Days are ten I know you're in here. Why don't you just come out so I can explain? Remember how we used to sit around and talk for hours about everything and nothing all at the same time? I miss that. I miss us. You know, nothing can keep us apart. Not a door, not the dark. Nothing. A love like ours lasts forever. Lulu! No! Listen to me. Just calm down and listen to me. Quiet. Be quiet and listen. What did I just walk in on? Nothing. This is nothing. I'm fine. What did you say to her? I was expressing my displeasure over the fact that you and your sister are accessories in the shooting that put Michael Corinthos in a coma. I had to tell him that he was going to... He was going to kill Jerry. Nobody kidnaps my son and keeps breathing. Well, if Jerry doesn't do it, you might as well put a bullet in both me and Johnny. You deserve it for backing Johnny into this corner. Leave her alone. He's right. I did this, John. I did this. I told you that I would take care of Sonny. I got his little boy shot instead. You could be next. I'm sorry. Let her go. She's trouble. Always has been, always will be. Why do you hate her so much? All she's ever done is try to protect me. Oh, wise up. In the end, 
Claudia only thinks about herself. She might think she's being loyal, but sooner or later she's going to turn on you just like her mother turned on me. It's what women do. Yeah. After men betray them first. Just calm down, Lulu! I will let you go if you'll just calm down, okay? Just calm down. All right? You see, was that so hard? Oh, son of a bitch! Mm. Ah, I just want to talk to you. Well, I, I want to listen, but it's hard when, you, when you're scaring me. Ah. Well, look, I'm sorry about the door. I didn't have a choice. Okay, I think that we both need to come down, so maybe you should leave before I can't. I can't. If I leave now, I will never have a chance to make you understand. Understand what? That we belong together. second chances i came back from iraq hating myself for what i did over there no one understood what it was like for me to leave home one person and come back a completely different person all right i was angry and on edge all the time but you saw past that you saw the real me buried beneath all the attitude i, I can still remember that night the surprise in your voice when you called me nice Lulu, i know i can be a better person if i'm with you Okay, I just need one last chance to make things right. Please. All right, just say, just, just say that you'll try again, okay? We should get you to the hospital, get you checked out. No, I will be fine once the room stops spinning. Hey, what do you remember? Um, Kate was getting ready for the benefit at the museum, and Logan showed up. He started professing his undying love for Lulu going on and on like a crazy stalker saying how they should be together and Lulu blew him off and then Logan got pissed. He came back here when he knew everyone was gone started railing on me for ruining his life. I tried to call security, that's when he grabbed me. I tried to fight back but he was really strong. That's the last thing you remember. Um, Logan standing over me, I wasn't sure if he was gonna rape me or kill me, probably both. I think someone was watching. How do you know? Well, he couldn't stop staring out the window. The best thing that's ever happened to me, I cannot lose you, not like this, okay? All I need is just one last chance to just make things right. And I want to believe that I've missed you. <sighs> Johnny, you never gave a damn about me. No! 